Hi there. Today we're going to show you how to import your contacts into Verifile. It's extremely easy to do, so let's jump right in and I'll show you how. So you're taking a look here at my home screen. You can see all of my workspaces here on the left. In order to import contacts, you're going to want to navigate to the Contacts tab by clicking it here in the upper left corner. Now you see this little plus button. That's where you add contacts. So if you want to add one at a time or if you want to add them in bulk, you're going to want to click this plus button to start. So I'm going to click the plus button. And you can see here it says enter first name, last name, and email address. If I wanted to add contacts one at a time, I would use these fields here. But what I want to do is import from a CSV file. So this is how we import in bulk into Verifile. CSV is a type of document not unlike a Microsoft Excel document where you can store information. So I'm actually going to quickly show you what a CSV document looks like with contact information on it. So let's take a look at that. Okay, this is a CSV file that has all of my contacts information on it. You can see there's a column that says first name on the left, last name, and then email address. This is what you need in order to import your contacts into Verifile. Now most software programs like Microsoft Outlook and Gmail will allow you to export your contacts in this format. You can look on YouTube to find videos that will show you how to export your contacts as a CSV file. But this is my list of contacts here. And the name of this file is My Contacts 2020. Now you might have an Excel version of this information. If that's the case, you're just going to want to save as a CSV. So almost every one of these spreadsheet programs, when you go to the file menu, you can see it says Save As. If you click Save As, you can always find a place where it'll tell you what file type. I'm choosing CSV here so that it saves as a CSV. So that's important because Verifile only accepts CSV files for importing your contacts. So let's go back to my Verifile. Okay, so we're back inside my Verifile account. I'm going to click the Import from CSV. I just showed you what my CSV file looks like with my contacts information on it. And now I can just either drag and drop or browse for my contacts file. I'm actually just going to go ahead and drag my contacts file in here. It uploads them all and it says it's ready to go so I'm going to click import 19 contacts. And now you can see on the far left all of my contacts are now inside Verifile. Just like that. And just as a reminder, anytime you want to just send a private message or a document to any single contact, just click their name and you can use this panel to start sharing. It's that simple.